All right, folks. So, yeah, I was recording and uh, everybody walked in and I thought I paused it, but I didn't. So, anyways, yeah, I went first, set Dimensional Barrier, Summon Glass Bell, Search Ice Bell, and also set Cosmic Cyclone. He summoned Joker. I used Dimensional Barrier and then he used Wisdom Eye, got the Iris. And yeah, we're, we're basically going back to my turn. Bam. Oh, we got a Scythe. That's pretty cool. So, we're going to activate this. Hopefully, he does not have a Max C or something like that because I don't want to use my Ash so fast. Oh, God. Well, I didn't want him to have that either, but that that sucks. We're going to set an invocation because <laughs> if we draw Alistair, we can just get another one. I definitely did not want to do that. And I can't really, now, now I'm forced to make moves, which sucks. Forced to make a bunch of moves. Um, unless he just did not draw a scale, but then again, I don't know. I, I think we could... Why didn't I set sight? It's because I'm an idiot. That, that's why. But, like I said, you Ash Blossom this, it really does not matter. That means you have a turn to kill me before I bring out another one. So, um, But if you just got two Ashes, you're just good. But yeah, this is why Ash, I feel like, is is way overpowered. It's because the, the this amount of cards it can hit is not even... Like, it's not fair. Like, Ghost Orker, sure. Waver nice. Um... Sure. Uh, well, I'm forced now. I'm forced to get rid of it. I'm forced to get rid of it because I don't. I, I'm just. Oh God, it hurts so much. I'm forced to get rid of. It. I'm pretty sure he has the astrograph or something in his hand, which is fine because that can't really do anything. Um, and I think I have to ask this. What scale is this? One. Um, this is gonna add another black thing. I'm forced. If you have, if you have another one, there's just nothing I can do about that. I can't, I can't play around all that cards. I can't play around everything. If you just have a scale eight, and I just, I can't beat you. There's just no way I was gonna. It was, I wasn't meant to beat you, and it's okay. But even if you do have a scale eight, the only thing you can put on someone is an Irish magician. I don't think you can destroy it. So even with that, it's still okay, I guess. Oh wow, you just Oh so you had the scales, you just didn't do it. What? So I'm guessing you're going Omega. I mean I'm guessing he's going Omega. Or he, he can't go to the Exceed. That's something he can do. Oh wait, never mind, I just lose it. No, because if you go to the Exceed he can't pendulum summon. Alright, so we're I I don't know why he didn't scale. That was dumb. I guess he wanted his Iris Magician that bad. Um, he can go into the uh, what's the name and pop astrograph, I guess. I know you don't. I'm pretty sure he doesn't play luster. So, I mean, if he played luster, it's just once again just wasn't. What are you doing? Okay, I'm not. Just don't understand. Oh wow, you're just gonna gonna injure. Oh, there we go. There's a magical meltdown. Um, what would be better right now? Hold on. All right, folks, so um, Magical Meltdown is cool, but I think we should just go Ice Bell. I think Ice Bell is a lot better. Uh, ooh, it's about to mess up and quit the game, but no, we got it. We got it good. Um, it doesn't matter because he doesn't have anything. Um, let's go ahead and get the Winter Bell. Special Summon. Um, okay, I forgot we can just Alistair right now. I forgot we, we still have our normal summon, so I, I really keep forgetting about that. Like, Alistair can still hit the board. Um, we need, uh, actually, never mind. I was about to say we needed a link, uh, a wind link, but you still couldn't even do that because of the uh, the restrictions. Only level 5 or higher can be summoned through the extra deck um, during this turn, so we're going to use this. Target the young glass bell. Hopefully, this can get, get us where we need to get. Go into our young crystal wing. Bam. I'm gonna set this in the spell and trap zone. And then we're gonna go off now. We're gonna attack over this. And so now his astrograph sorcerer, while he can um, I mean there's no reason to activate. No reason. I probably should have attacked with Alistair first. Definitely should have attacked with Alistair first. 
that's something I definitely should have did because then I could have negated Astrograph and gained 2500 because I am, it's still in the hand when it's getting destroyed. Yeah, so that would have been, um, I actually would have been a thousand and then 55 over 18. So it would have been an extra 2500 damage right now. He would have been at 2000. So there's nothing he can do top deck unless he plays what's the name. And then it's just not fair. Unless he plays uh, Sky Iris, not Sky Iris, but Odd Ice Fusion. But yeah, be right back. Alrighty, folks, back again. So let's see what we can do with this. Um, sure, that's that's fine. That's that's completely fine. Um, this hand is okay. This hand is okay. Um, tricks. Oh my god. No, it's not. It's not okay anymore. Now it's not okay. And he can literally destroy me. Ooh, secrets. Um, let's set Sanctum because I like that card. Set secrets. Set barrier. Um, so let's do that. Let's activate the young Alistair. We're going to get that. Sure, we're going to get hit with two, but that's completely fine. Reincarnation. Ooh, now that's actually really good. So what we can do here is knowledge. There's an Ash Blossom, so now we, yeah, now we, we just win now. Now we just win. Now we just win, folks. Where you at? Glass Bell. Yep, yep. One, two. Do, 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 do. Take another 200, but that's fine. That's fine. That 200 is completely fine. Special summon. Bam. Then we can go into our winter bell. Pretty sure he's going to have a what's the name down there. Pretty sure that's the scapegoat down there. Like 3,000% sure that's the scapegoat. Do you have a gold soaker or something? Because that'd hurt. That'd really hurt. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty sure he has a scapegoat. So I, I pre, pre, I'm, I'm, I'm just going gonna, I'm gonna to take, take in the fact that it's a pretty good thing to do right now. Um, if he plays that new card, we're in trouble. But he doesn't. Okay, so now we can set another dimensional barrier. Might, might as well keep the keep the card limit in our hand a little down. Yeah, that's a scapegoat. That's fine. Like I said, we have a what's the name for him? If he tries to borrow load me and use the effect to snatch, we can negate it. But he can just he can just put it down the what's the name. But we also have moral tech, so that's another good thing. Is because. Uh, we have one Alistair left. That's that's that's, that's kind of crappy. Um, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait till he wastes two. Cause Borload. Um, yeah. Let's let's sink them right now. If he has an Ash, I'm just gonna start crying. Nope, he doesn't have an Ash. All right, so let's. <laughs> All right, be back. Actually, we can end it right there. We got two. Well, we got a half a duel and then one good duel. So yeah, that's good. Here is the deck list once again. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys did have a lot of fun watching that because uh, yeah, man, this is Wind Witches. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. I will see you guys um, tomorrow with Thursday's upload. So stick around for that. And next week, um, I don't remember what I said I wanted to play. Oh, I wanted to play a flip deck like Sub Terrors. And then I, I think I wanted to play Spirits or something else i know i wanted to play sub terrors next week so um do you guys have any good builds or anything like that leave them down in the comments below uh yeah so yeah that's it for today um i hope you guys did enjoy it so that's good right there and if you guys would like to support the channel all i ask for you guys to do is click an ad that is enough for me thank you very much and i will see you guys tomorrow so yeah